Coaches.tv with uh, Coach Wink. Um, how's it going today, Coach? That's uh, great. You know, end of the day. Uh, okay. Um, Kyle Nook is having a, a fight coming up here with uh, Ed Herman, I believe, who was a replacement. Uh, how is he looking with his preparations? Kyle's looking good. You know, his speed's at a whole new level. I mean, his game is changing. It's evolving. He's got some fantastic stand-up that most people have not even seen. Is it difficult when there is a, a you know a replacement like to get a fighter ready for a new opponent? Yeah, a little bit. We got to change the game plan a little bit, but it's a day-to-day -day thing. We're just always working on uh, the meat and potatoes, making sure that when we hit somebody, it hurts them, but being in the right place at the right time. And Kyle has a nice little win streak going here um, in the UFC and going back a little ways. How has he developed as a fighter over the years? You know what? I think the biggest thing for Kyle has been the mental game. You know, he's starting to believe in himself, and he knows when to turn it on. And that's huge. He, he believes in those techniques, so they become a real valuable asset for him. And how long is it? You know, Kyle also fought in another promotion before, and you've been working with him for quite a long time, correct? Oh, yeah. Yeah, he was fighting with, I guess, Elite. Um, yeah, probably before it was Strike Force, yeah. And um, one other thing, you know, with Kyle, it, it does seem like he's gotten um, a lot quicker. Is that a byproduct of the of conditioning and strength drills and also the striking drills that you do with him? I think it's repetition, and I think he's starting to understand, uh, throw things and use quick twists. We do a lot of uh, more in, in uh, sprint-type activities, and it's, it's becoming inherent in his motion. Okay, well, we look forward to seeing you um, at the fights. Thanks. This is Jackson's.tv with UFC, UFC fighter Kyle Noak. Um, Kyle, you have a fight coming up here um, with Ed Herman. Um, how do you feel about this matchup? Uh, I feel really good, you know. Uh, training's been going well. Um, you know, I feel great. I feel in good shape. It's going to be a good fight. And you have a nice little win streak going um, now. Um, how does it feel to be in the UFC mm -hmm. and having, you know, uh, multiple wins now? Um, it feels good to win in any, any organization, you know, but uh, UFC's the the best of the best so um, you know I, I love being in there I love getting the recognition for uh, all the hard work I put in mm -hmm. and you know we took some video of you uh, you know working striking with Wink and we did an interview with Wink as well um, how do you feel like your striking has developed since working with uh, coach Wink um, it, it's developed tremendously you know uh, I think Mr. Wink is one of the best in the business um, he's, he's just sharpened my whole game up uh, Put some power, more power behind all my punches and kicks. Um, you know, he's just he's turning me into a uh, total mixed martial artist. And on a more uh, personal note, are you now living in the states full time or going back and forth? No, I'm living here full time now. I uh, purchased a house not long ago, so I'm uh, a New Mexico native now, I guess. And um, so, are you going to be bringing over your family to visit, or are you going to go back home? Uh, my family's going to come visit after the fight. Uh, you know, it's. Uh, They'll come for a little while and visit, which is good. All right. Um, thank you for your time, Kyle, and uh, good luck at the fight. No problem. Thank you.